developing story out of Texas, something of a mystery. New information is out tonight in the death of Sandra Blant. Now, as Brandy Hitt reports, questions are being asked about whether police could be at fault in this woman's death behind bars. This surveillance video captures the moment jail personnel realized Sandra Bland was dead, found hanging in her cell just three days after her controversial arrest. The 28-year-old activist pulled over for failing to signal a lane change. And when forced to get out of her car, the arresting officer writes in his report, Bland began swinging her elbows at me and then kicked my right leg in the shin. She just said that she... She really felt that she, her arm had been fractured. But the jail claims while you can't see Bland's cell in this video, her health was intact. There were no reported injuries by Ms. Bland and no additional medical treatment was requested. At 7.55 a.m., officers claim Bland asked to make a phone call. That call was never made. Then at 8.58, you see a guard discover Bland. They say a trash bag was wrapped around her neck. There wasn't much of anything there, so of course that still was lingering questions. Texas Rangers are leading the investigation with the help of the FBI, but civil rights leaders want more. I'm here to tell you that discrimination is alive and well in Waller County. And an investigation has to be done by the Department of Justice. The district attorney's office says it's too early to determine if this was murder or suicide, but it's treating this case like a murder investigation. In the meantime, Sandra Bland's family is awaiting its own independent autopsy. In Los Angeles, Brandy Hitt, ABC 7 News.